you know. No. <gasps> so it was good. That's, it's not the point. I, it's, it's personal. I don't want to talk about it. Talk about what? Marty got back on the horse last night. I wondered. Gee, thanks, Dawn. Yeah, I'm sorry, she's, she's not a horse. She's lovely, Bridget. She looked nice. Oh, so you saw her. And did it look like the beginning of a beautiful new romance? Dawn. Maybe. <laughs> Look, it's just complicated, that's yeah, all. Yeah, because she was his wife's bestie. Mm. Not that there's anything wrong with that. You know, they both loved her and it's brought them closer than ever, right? Yeah, that's probably it. Yeah, you know, you, you've bonded through the same grief. Well, it's not exactly the same, but it's that's kind enough. of... That's enough. Okay, Dawn. Last night was a mistake. And it's not going to happen again, so just leave it alone. It's, it's funny you never mentioned it. Well, it was at the back of my mind. Well, way, way back. Yeah, well, now she's gone and spoiled everything. Pretty easy. Well, yes, who else? By going with her boyfriend. Oh, if you're going to get all real life on it. As opposed to what? I am still Queen of Condor. An imaginary world full of pimply teenagers. Cosplay is very age-inclusive, I'll have you know. Yes, I, I stand corrected. Full of pimply people of all ages and weird net beds. Oh. Hey, what, why are you even going? You and Dizzy are just going to snipe at each other all night and get half cut and have a brawl in the car park to the tune of DJ D Jizzle. Rest in peace, my ears. There you go again. The ball is hours away and you're already having a miserable time. Thanks to her. Look, I know you guys have history, but Damo is with Dizzy now and they're happy together, Mum. But it doesn't mean that he and I can't be friends. Absolutely. But they're a combo deal. Okay, and if you can't handle her, you might lose him too.